Hi, we're the Annies. This is George. And welcome to Theatre Lounge Live. The sun will come out tomorrow. Bet your bottom dollar that tomorrow there'll be sun. Just thinking about tomorrow. Clears away the cobwebs and the sorrow. Hey guys, welcome back to Theater Lounge Live. Oh my God, you guys were amazing. <laughs> oh my God, we're with the fabulous cast, the Annies from Annie on the West End. We've got Lola, we've got Ruby, and we've got Maddie. Hi, how are you guys? Good, good. good. Oh, so cool, isn't this so cool? We have like a ton of people watching on Facebook right now. Isn't that like so meta? Look at that, here you are. Um, if you're just tuning in, um, we, we have the cast here. If you guys have any questions, I'll be monitoring the questions right here from Facebook. Um, and, uh, well, the first question I have is that you guys are playing the iconic musical theater role of a lifetime. Tell me, what is it like to be playing Annie in Annie? <laughs> oh, it's amazing. I mean, who would have thought we'd be Annie? I know, it's right? just <laughs> surreal. And so, like, like, what are you thinking? Like, do, how do you prepare for the role? Like, what, like, how does it to be Annie? It's, it's just fab. I mean, every show is so different and it's just fab to do it and I just love it. Yeah, it's kind of amazing because you always grew up watching Annie and you never dream one day you're actually going to be Annie. <laughs> it's like, oh. Maddie, when you got the call like that you were going to play Annie, like what is that? I mean, what, what, what did you do? I was just like, I was a bit like startled. I was like, I didn't really know what to say. I was like, oh my God. It's kind of a dream come true be a star in a western yeah. show. It is, right here Every at the... kid's dream. I mean, and on the Piccadilly Theatre stage. Yeah. It's so it's yeah. so fantastic. But this is... You guys have worked together before, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah. so tell me, what show are you guys in? Um, School, School, School of Rock. Rock. School of Rock. Oh, my God, that's amazing. Yeah. Uh, yeah. That's so fantastic. So you guys... So tell me a little bit about, like, what is life like backstage? You have a, a bunch of the kids and then a bunch of adults. It sounds like a crazy party, right? It's, tell it's me about really it. fun. Yes. Yeah. 
everyone's really relaxed and if anyone's nervous we will calm each other down and it's just it's really yeah. chilled yeah. And it's like a yeah. family oh yeah, it's really like one big musical family yeah. Yeah. <laughs> everyone's <laughs> watching from the wings when you're not on everyone's you can always That's see on TV. You. oh really TV. Yeah. yeah so what about what about when the others are on like during easy street are you guys like yeah. back there like yeah, yeah, music? The dancing. Yeah. we learned the dances <laughs> Oh, fantastic. did you really? Yeah. Oh, fantastic. Oh, that's so great. That would be fun. All right, all right. So um, one quick question is that, you know, the, the locket is so symbolic in Annie. Um, really quickly, what, what would you have written on your locket? Um, I'd keep it as Annie because it's yeah. just a memory to keep forever. And it's just really, it's quite precious, really. Oh, fantastic. Okay, what about you, yeah, Ruby? I would have Annie as well, but maybe my family members as well and something things that are special to you. Okay, this yeah. has to be a big locket then. Yeah. <laughs> what about yeah. you, Maddie? I'd keep it um, as Annie because, like Lola said, it's quite symbolic and every time you look down, it's like a memory you'll always remember. Mm -hmm. It's yeah. like a keepsake. Oh, fantastic. All right, well, <laughs> if you guys are just tuning in, we're at Theatre Lounge Live. We are with the Annies from Annie, and these, they're so awesome. We've been having so much fun today, just giggling and laughing at <laughs> rehearsals. Um, and, uh, and give it up for George. He was an, he's amazing. <laughs> Don't you just love George? <laughs> hi, uh, George. Hi. Um, okay, great. So I'm, I'm looking on, on Facebook here. We got some really great, um, great things. To do. Oh, okay. So in the show, this is a great question um, from Ryan. So in the show, um, Sandy is played by an actual dog. It's not like a stuffed animal or anything. <laughs> this is an actual beautiful dog that yeah. comes out. And, and so first yeah. of all, so this question is from Ryan O'Neill. Has the dog ever decided to leave halfway through a scene or not come on at all? Uh, yeah, um, when I was <laughs> oh, no. on, um, he ran on to get the treat and then he just ran off again. So I had to like go, go off the stage and then bring him back on. It was really funny. Uh, so what is the do Is there multiple dogs? Or no, is just, it just one. Just oh, one. okay. Amber. Amber. Yeah, oh, so cute. oh, she is out of, I mean, she like, and it, well. it's amazing. Yeah. And the show is so fantastic. It, it, yeah. Congratulations, you guys. It's really, it's <laughs> just, it's just a wonderful, wonderful show. Um, Okay, cool. So, oh, Lottie, hi, Lottie, um, asks, how old are the girls? Okay, so, Lolo, how old are you? Um, I'm 12. 12? 12. 12? I'm 13. 13. Okay, great, great. Uh, and so, so you guys have been doing theater for a while, though. Like, is this, so tell me, like, what are some of the, pre we know about School of Rock, like, mm -hmm. tell me about some of the previous things. Um, I, would do, I did the Sound of Music tour last year, okay. when I was Brigitte, and that was so much fun. Oh, my yeah. God, Brigitte. <laughs> yeah. That's the best. She's <laughs> <laughs> <Jeez. laughs> in... Name is when I was little. Oh, no and big then, deal. And then I did <laughs> Matilda oh, musical. Yep. Mm -hmm. And then I did BFG, but that was in the Birmingham Repertory Company. And then I did School of Rock with Lola, and I did Annie UK tour, which was oh, the fantastic. same company. That it's is amazing. So yeah, just I mean, she's done more at thirteen than I have my entire life. Great, great. What about you, Lola? What have you done? Um, School of Rock. And okay. Then this. Oh, yeah. fantastic. I mean, what a, you you guys are so incredible. Um, you know, it's, it's interesting, too, that there's, um, this cast is so, so fantastic. And there's so many people. This is yeah. a huge show. Yeah. There's even a ton of people behind the scenes, too, that are... Mm -hmm. So, yeah, like, w d there's sort of an energy that happens around here. Talk mm -hmm. about that. It's incredible. Yeah. 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 It's always so hyper, relaxed. Yeah. I don't yeah. know. <laughs> Everyone's always <laughs> laughing or making yeah. jokes. Yeah. yeah, lots of jokes. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> Oh, George, George, I guess George has all the jokes here. George, oh, you can see him in the monitor in, in the show, and, like, you can hear him. In the, la in the last song, we have to go bong, 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 and it's really hard. He's like, and he's like... <laughs> <laughs> he looks like a fish. <laughs> That's amazing. That's amazing. Okay, so um, a bunch of people asking, like, how do you even get, like, how do you even get into um, doing musicals and theater at such a young age? Lots of auditions. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, fantastic. Yeah, right. Any any advice you can give to other uh, other other kids who might be interested in getting into musical theater, theater in general? Yeah, yes. yeah and just, just be yourself. If okay. it means a lot to you, then you just strive towards your what you want to yeah. achieve. Yeah. Because it's gonna be like yeah, it seems really scary, but it's not. It's, yeah. it's really fun. Well, is is life different? I mean, is it different as a as a, as a kid in a, in a West End show? Like, uh, tell me a little bit about how it's different when you're hanging out with your friends from back home or, yeah. or, or your to cousins. Miss school. Oh no! no. <laughs> you do actually have a tu you actually do have a tutor, and you do have school. Yeah, we don't miss out any work. Yeah, <laughs> that is amazing. Okay, so then um, Taylor Taylor Smith Chandler, hi, um, wants to know what it's like being in a show full of kids. 
Oh, it's really fun because um, in some shows, like when there's only adults, it's a bit like weird. But then when you've got kids as well, it's really like mm. laid back and everyone's not alone. laughing. It's like a and, party. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> in the dressing rooms, <laughs> every day. before the show, you're like half out cool. Everyone's like doing their hair yeah. and yeah. plaiting. It's, it's a bit crazy. manic. You don't like take a bunch of like sugar right before you eat. Like, <laughs> you're not like, okay, no, no, it's not like. <laughs> no, we don't. I feel like I would do that. I'd just be like, get a bunch of M&Ms and be like, okay, here we go. <laughs> I'm ready. <laughs> oh, no, no. That's it. Okay, so Molly Roberts wants to know what your favorite costume in the show is of either yours or of someone else's. Because the costumes are incredible, too, though. That's a yeah, really, really big... I like the nun costume. The nun. <laughs> <laughs> Well, Maddie, we got the yeah, best costume. Yeah. She's the <laughs> of course. <laughs> I, I really like the party dress at the end. Yeah, yeah. definitely. It's so it's it's. Uh, this one's color. What's the funniest moment you've experienced on stage? I'm sure you have a million of them, but what is one that was just hilarious? Well, <laughs> this happened a couple of times. And we have to give the dog treats, like when she's good. And once I accidentally spilt the treats all over the floor. <laughs> <laughs> and then when I was singing, Amber was like going around trying to get all the oh, treats. Oh, she was, she was picking up all the, <laughs> yeah. eating all the treats. Oh my God. <laughs> what about you guys? Have you... Um, well, when you sing tomorrow, you have to crouch down on the floor and you sing to the dog. Okay. And she licks your face. Yeah, one time it was so bad that I was singing every note and then you just had this like tongue in your face just licking you every word that you sang. Yep, yep. That's, that's <laughs> pretty normal. funny. Yeah. <laughs> what about you? Oh, wow. Well. Um, I had my school watching one night and um, when, and I think I'm going to like it, you sit on a trolley and you're like wheeled around and oh. the person wheeling the trolley tripped. So I was like holding on to the trolley for dear life and my, like, my, all my skirt is in my head. And I just carried on singing. It's really funny. Yeah, the trolley has a lot of problems. Once my wig got stuck on the button of the guy and like I was supposed to be spinning around on this like thing. I don't even know what it is. But, um, and I couldn't get there in time because I was just stuck. I was just had to sing my line from the trolley, like with my plaid stuck yeah. in. And I was like, used to. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. That is the magic of live theater, yeah. folks. Like that is why you need to see the show. It could be, and it does. It does feel like it's something different every night, right? Yeah, I mean, the definitely. audience response. Talk about that. Like, how 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 does that feel? Uh, you get a different audience every night, but mm. the show you just keep doing what you're doing but it just gets better every every yeah. show yeah mm -hmm. and working with the fabulous miranda hart yeah, how is that amazing. she's she's, 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 she's so lovely funny. as she she's is in so person funny. yeah she's so yeah, funny, she actually she's is. So funny. Like, and yeah. um and then craig revel horwood is joining mm -hmm. uh yeah. uh in september and you did you work with craig before on no, the tour? Did. you did okay great he's fantastic so he's cool. gonna be so <laughs> good at mrs hannigan yeah. like it's gonna be amazing. It's so it's so good. It's so definitely, great. definitely. Um, okay, so let me see. Let's check Facebook. Any more any more fun questions coming in? Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Okay, so so many iconic numbers. I mean, the it's even when you see Annie, you're just like, what? I forgot all of these huge musical numbers, like one after another. It's probably hard to tell, but which one is your favorite musical number out of the show? Um, um, well, I love. Tomorrow so Hard Up Life, but I mean, I like Something Was Missing, and that's the number where um, Mr. Warbuck sings to Annie. Oh, yeah. It's just a really emotional part of the show. It's really, it's, it's really sweet. I love it. I like all the dance numbers. Yeah. yeah. You like the dance, like, um, Anything But You, it's got a massive dance break in yeah. it, and I like yeah. that. It's so fun and yeah. energetic, and yeah. the audience yeah. really get involved as well. Yeah, it's all really clapping in there. Yeah. <laughs> NYC, when oh, they break down. Oh, that one it's as such well. a great one. Oh, my God, I love it. I love it. Um, okay, so what would be this? Is just, what would be your dream West End part when you grow up? So many. I know. <laughs> dream girls. Dream girls. All oh, right, I like that. Girls. Yeah. <laughs> what about you? Uh, I don't know because there's so many, but maybe something in Wicked, like Alpha or something. Oh, Alphaba. Yeah, when Do you she hear that? The Future yeah. Alphaba here. Yeah. Okay, what about you, Maddie? That and I like like Nina in, in the Heights. That's a good one. Oh, yeah. fantastic. I like, I'd like to be old Repanine in Les Mis. <laughs> <laughs> that would be fun. That would be full circle. Yeah. That is, yeah. That is yeah, amazing. Um, okay, okay, okay. D -d 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 -d. We've got some really great stuff in here. Lots of people are just like loving the show too. Like they, they are, what is, what is it like going to, to stage door afterwards? Do you get to meet a lot of other kids? Who are yeah, like, they don't yeah. recognize us. Once I really? walked out and my friend went, oh, she was Annie. But like, that's not Annie. And I was like, yeah, it only because sometimes that like, you walk past and someone actually clocks it, and then everyone's yeah. like, 
Oh my gosh. Yeah, yeah. they don't recognise you because of the wig. Mm. And most of someone thought I was lying. They went, which one of you's Annie? And I was like, me? They went, you're lying. That's not, that's not Annie. Oh they my god. <laughs> Some people actually think your hair is literally yeah, actually they do. red. Wow. There are other times that's just... I know this is this seems like a crazy. But have you? Uh, did you guys know about Annie before? Like, were you were you raised on it? Like, yeah. it was just like one of those things that have. Yeah. You, it's, yeah. It's, yeah. Like family film. yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. I've watched it about a hundred times. Yeah. Yeah. Was there like a special moment with you and your family that you were like w- you together, like watched the movie or have seen the show before that you were like that that was a, a strong memory? And then... Um. Well, before we did Annie in the West End, I went to watch it with my mum and my sister in the tour, and. We watched it, and my mum was like, you could be Annie one day. And I was like, no. Oh, my God. <laughs> Look at me now, Ma. <laughs> yeah. That's amazing. Yeah. Oh, fantastic. Our yeah. moms are probably sat watching. Yeah. Oh, your moms are watching right now. No, we don't know. They probably are. Probably drinking coffee. Yeah, like. I was just yeah. about to say, they're probably sat in a coffee shop. Now. Say hi to the moms, then. Hey, Mom. Hi, Mom. <laughs> Oh my gosh! Well, I think that's I think that's fantastic. So many people are just loving the show and just absolutely love love the experience of Annie. So thank you so much for providing that nightly at the Piccadilly Theater. The show has been extended until February, so you must 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 come out and see this fantastic show. It is just uh, lovely. Uh, any last words? Anything you want to say to the to fans? Come and watch. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. Well, th- thank you again for tuning in to Theatre Lounge Live, brought to you by American Theatre Wing, Live View, and, of course, Official London Theatre. You can get tickets to Annie through officiallondontheatre.com, or, of course, you can go to anniewestend.com and uh, get some information. You can read all of their lengthy bios and... Uh, Uh, buy tickets to the show. So thank you so much, and uh, we'll see you at the next Theatre Launch Live. Thank you. Bye. Bye.